Hey guys, Wayne here from HT Tech Video. Today I want to show you how to reset your Aquatil Fierce XL back to factory settings. To do this, um, first thing you're going to do is swipe down from the top, tap up here, go to the settings wheel, and you want to go to where it says accounts, and then tap on Google, and then tap on the email that you have set up, and then the three dots upper right corner, and you're going to first hit remove account. This is actually not our phone, so we're not gonna remove it, but you would remove the account first, and the reason for that is Google has a new security feature, and if you don't remove your email and reset the phone, and then you try to log back into your the phone, it will ask you for the password for that original email account. If you don't have it, guess what? You can no longer use the phone because the phone is sort of registered under that email and so you have to unsync it first so that you don't end up with that problem later. You probably will say to yourself, well doesn't everybody have the password to their email? No. In fact, a lot of people don't have that password. Imagine if you were trying to sell this phone to someone and you factory reset it and then once they get it, the phone is asking for your email password. You don't want that kind of stuff to happen so always remove the account first. Once you do that, we're going to go to backup and reset, tap on factory data reset, you're going to tap reset phone and it should ask you one more thing and then uh, it should say erase everything and once it does that the phone will begin to reset everything, it will erase all your information and the phone will set up like brand new. So um, again, this isn't our phone, we have to give this back to someone, so we're not going to do the actual factory reset, but those are the two steps, remove Google account, and then back up and reset, and erase everything. I hope you guys did find this helpful, make sure you like, favorite, and share the video if it was helpful, make sure you also subscribe to HG Tech Videos, and as always, have a good one.